you, know, you have an issue with the Mjolnir damage bouncing around. Uh, Mone, Mone jumps on here, and then comes the Omni Slash as well, trying to make it over to the Shrine. He's popped the BKB as well. Lanham actually helping take Good. some of the Omni Slash and then getting the egg off. This could be really bad. Nisha getting ripped apart, but does manage to bring down the egg just before he goes down and trying to drive him back into the mess here. Vacuum comes in, but now mid one joining in the spot. He's picked up a BKB. It's a no where did he get that? But he's just turned the fight apart. RNG are absolutely going to disappear. And Secret once again. Setsu is leading the charge. He's got that BKB ready to roll. Gonna run into that clone, which unfortunately will pop their smoke right now. Just running into them right now. You're gonna have to deal with this, but in comes a Batrider, oh, no. immediately dragging back the Earthshaker, and guess what? He's got the life stealer inside of him oh, right no. now. Mono's forced to fight this one. The Echo actually comes down. It's doing quite a lot, but Lanham will still be dropped. Mono trying to find a target right now, but won't be able to find one. Flyby already gone from this. Mono realizing this fight is probably over. Doesn't have to work with it. Just gets brought down, punched into the air. But back comes Lanham with the Fisher from the high ground, but not doing enough. Setsu, though, staying alive, actually bringing down mid one as well. So still surviving through all of this somehow. Zai on the backlands trying to bring down Lanham. Meanwhile, Nisha, he's just fighting up into Setsu, and that will finally put an end to his Death Prophet's reign of terror. Meanwhile, Zai trying to look for Lanham on the backlands here, being slowed down a little bit, but Arfu just being it's melted be by dieback. Nisha. There is too much damage, and Lanham, he's going to get run down as well. The dieback did nothing. In, in terms of like the overall thing of the game, like, oh, there's a fight going on first. Hello, oh. Ancient Apparition. Well, it's my dog. Oh, Lanham coming in with a huge slam. Where is the follow-up damage, though? RNG trying to get into this one. They do bring down Puppy, and now Secret forced to get themselves back here. But do they have the damage? They're running through Yaps, or they certainly do. Nisha's still getting a fair amount off on the back lines. They'll take care of the clone, and now they look towards Zai as well, and they're going to grab themselves another three dead on the side of Secret, and now they're looking for more. Lanham with the blink in. Bane buys back. They're looking to defend this one, but the tower's already gone. The Hex comes down to Lysio, and now they get got Lasso onto both of them. That is fantastic, but the Guardian Angel coming in, trying to save him. The Quintus Curse, the hold still oh, the from the Bane. That's the one they hold him down. DP getting so low. Finally, Setsu is dead, and this fight should be over. RNG needs to get out. They can't fight without the Exorcism, but they're just jumping in so deep. Arfu is gone as well. Flyby getting low. He's got the heals, but is it going to be enough? The Echo comes in, but it seems to be just trying to make space more than anything as Lanham instantly dies afterwards. They got the lockdown onto Flyby as well. I don't think he's getting out of this when he throws down the heavily grace but it is going to be another kill for team secret this they weren't really expecting this axe <laughs> they weren't were they and uh last year it's actually hexed up on the front lines there are great shards as well holding him still going in deep here looking for maybe zai or somebody but money can't yeah, really so they're just trying to ignore this clone right now but they can't really do that flyby's getting low they got the lasso we get double lasso onto them both the sets who does get the bkb off this time Flyby dies, which cancels out the lasso onto the Death Prophet. Meanwhile, they found themselves Ancient Apparition. Ancient Apparition on the high ground. They've got That's no Omni Knight either, and this is bad. This is really bad. All of a sudden, Secret turn this one around. They're trying to go for the Death Prophet as well. She dies, and this is over. They're trying to get the damage off onto mid one right now. The Abyssal Blade comes out onto him as well. They need to find the damage. They need to get the kill. Mid one bashed up on the high ground. Do they have the damage? Yes, they do. Mid one goes down. He's got the buyback, though. He can come back into this one. How do you even defend this one? Is it going onto the Death Prophet? She does not have buyback. Death Prophet is dead. Um, it's just Mone and Lana first is the world. Can I make it happen? I really don't think so. Mone trying to fight it up. Does bring down Yapsil. No They're still fighting it up, but they don't have the control and in comes Zai as well. Surely this is it. Down goes Yapsil, but again, just buying back. Secret just seemed to have so many more resources as Mone tries to take a train out of here. Turning this one around. A beautiful Fisher onto both. They're going to get the kill onto Zai. Are they really doing this? Are they really holding this long? They'll kill off Lanham. He has buyback. Coming back into this one. Mone trying to chase down Nisha. Nisha onto the high ground right now. The open wind comes out onto him. Yapsil coming in though he's got the punch where to use it but there's the echo slam and that is gonna hold him still it's a rampage for money the two-man defense is it real they're trying to pop the bkb they're trying to turn this one around mid one it's just a brawl up on the high ground right now i could drop in so low inside the snowball buys him the time money though he's just fighting up finally the lasso comes in zai is back they have the control and money money he's still not dead how is this man still alive the life stealer which cannot die finally getting himself back to the high ground the Supports are nearly back into this one as Lysia still just being the manliest of men. Finally bought down once, but he's got the buyback again. He can come back in and keep defending this one. They haven't even taken the middle lane racks yet. He's coming back. He's got the rage. He's saying, get off my base. I know how strong I am. Mone is the man who cannot be touched right now. And he will chase back Team Secret time and time again.